basic concrete texture. And so then I'll have the uh, base done for when I go to make it look like it just rained. That's what it's gonna look like in the end. Hi, um, I'm Phoebe Leisinger. I'm a scenic painter here at Arizona State University. Scenic painting is such an underrated part of theater because we're just following instructions, which I just think is so important to have something look good and the time and work that goes into painting a set is astounding when you actually think about it. So much work goes into a show. Um, when you see a show, you have to consider that that show's been in production for about two years. Like, from start to end, it takes about two years to get a show running, let alone how long it runs for. Because you have to have a scenic design, you have to have the technical director, you have to have people to do their jobs, and they have to do it right. Which, you know, in a learning institution, it's going to take a little bit longer. When you go see a show, it's really important that you, like, you look at the names on the list of, like, wow, this person spent hours of their life dedicated to this show, days of their life. Any show can be okay with great acting. Any show. But in order for you to be sucked into the world and not be like, that looks weird, or something like that, it's really important to have good scenic painting, good sound, good lighting. When you're working on a show, you have to work, I believe the requirement is 90 hours on the show over the whole two-month span, but like, it's, that's just not enough time. It's the, that's the bare minimum requirement. If you want to go the extra mile, you have to be in here every day. Every day you're not in class. 